Yeah, Paul Murphy spent the day in St. Bernard Parish where preparations are already underway. Getting old, I tell you that. Zach Campo and Ricky Bowden spent the morning moving their crab traps on shore. It's the seventh time in recent months the Hopedale based commercial fishermen have pulled their baskets out of the water with tropical weather approaching the Louisiana coast. You get to fish for two weeks and then you got to pick up. It's starting to get like a uh, normal, normal thing. It's frustrating when you're making money and you got to pick these things up, I tell you that. But you got to do it. You got to do it. It's better to be safe than sorry. Pam Guerra lives in Lower St. Bernard Parish. She thought her family was done with hurricanes for the year, but Gara says it looks like Zeta will be the last hurrah in what has been a very eventful hurricane season this year. We tired of it. Gara and many of her neighbors are once again moving their boats and trailers out of harm's way. We tired of moving all of this stuff back and forth, back and forth. We love it down here, and that's the only reason why we do what we do. St. Bernard fishing guide Preston Harden is also preparing to get out. The water's still warm out there, and this one's coming, and I'm seeing them hauling the campers, and I guess I'm going to haul my camper. I don't want to get flooded. It's just do I do it today or wait one more day? Zeta is now forecast to reach the Louisiana coast at or near hurricane strength on Wednesday. And forecasters say there is now an increasing risk of storm surge, heavy rains, and damaging winds here in St. Bernard. Just be careful, folks. Like I say, you know, we're sorry to tell you this again, but don't let your guard down. Be ready. Be prepared. St. Bernard Homeland Security Director John Ram now expects a four to six foot storm surge from Zeta. Two to five inches of rain between now and Thursday and 70 to 80 mile per hour winds overnight on Wednesday. In St. Bernard Parish, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News.